Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome to a FIFA 19 pack opening video. Today I'm going to bring you guys the highlights of 36k FIFA points worth of packs, roughly around £200. As you guys can tell by the title, we do in fact pack pull ourselves a 90 rated player. So if you guys enjoy, make sure to smash the like button, let's see if we can hit targets of 1000 likes. Now of course, if you guys are new to the channel, it would be greatly appreciated if you could subscribe. Of course, do turn on that notification bell as well to get notified when my next video does in fact hit the sub box. Hopefully tomorrow, the first sniping reactions of FIFA 19, so make sure to keep your eyes peeled. Anyway, with the introduction out of the way, we'll go straight into this video. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, and hopefully I will see you next time. Have you packed Carrasco yet? Here's a non-rare or not. Uh, I have not packed Carrasco yet. Oh, boards! It's Socrates. No, it's not. Manalas! Yes! Manalas looks so sick as well, dude. 83 pace, 86 defending, 82 physical. What a pack pull. What a player. Dude, this card looks so good. What are the chances of getting an 85 rated card? Isn't it like 1% as well? Dude, that's so legit. I'll happily take that. Costas Manalas. This is probably like one of the best centre-backs on the game as well, by the, by the way, guys. So, an amazing pack pull right here. You guys are insane. Thank you ever so much, everyone that is choosing to chill in the stream today. Spending, guys, your time watching. It's greatly appreciated. Handanovic. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. It's all black. It's all black. We just got a 90 rated all black. Dude. Dude. I can't believe I've just got that. That is honestly the most cringe walkout celebration ever, but still, like, I don't even care at this stage. 90 rate dot black. Oh my days, boys. What? I mean, 90 rate dot black. Hello? I want. Do you reckon there's even any of him on the market? Compare price? Dude, someone's listed one up at 60k. Why would you list him up at 60k? He's going to be worth well more than that in a couple of days' time. We got a 90-rated walkout, lads. A 90-rated walkout. That is unreal. That is honestly unbelievable at this stage already. I mean, like, the game, the game's not even, like, technically out yet. And we've already got ourselves one of the highest-rated cards on the game. Here it is. Back-to-back -back boards. I was joking. Brazil! No! Fabinho! No! Luke! Yes! Anarchy! Lucas Leiva! Lucas Leiva! What a legend. I'm so happy he's actually a boards now as well. Okay, for a second, I was thinking we might have been getting Fabinho. Which would have been sick. But I mean, Lucas Leiva is the next best thing, right? Like, he's genuinely, like, one of my favourite players of all time. Obviously, being a Liverpool fan. Massive Liverpool legend. Um, compare his price. How do I compare price again? Yeah, why? Couple of him on the market. His card looks decent as well this season. What do you guys think? Like, his card looks decent. I'm happy with that pack pull again. We've actually had some decent cards, in all honesty. We've had a few boards and, obviously, um, like a 90-rated player as well. How do you know when you have a walkout? I don't know. There is a way of being able to tell. I'm not really too sure about it at the moment, though, dude. Unless people from chat know. I mean, that's such ironic timing because we literally just... Uh... Wait! Xavi Martinez! 84 rated! And we literally just went ahead and got ourselves a YouTube subscriber as well. Thank you ever so much, Avesta. Welcome. You get to use my uh, customised emotes now as well. Get, get to have a little penguin next to your name whilst you're chatting. Dude, maybe you're a good luck charm. It's just got ourselves another board. Actually, your highest rated card as well so far. We get Callum Chambers. Shout out Capcom Tom. Uh, sorry, shout out to the Gamer Can. Don't know why I said Capcom Tom. Clearly not Tom. But yeah, Javi Martinez is not bad. 51 pace. I've always liked this card in game though, even though he's been slow every year on FIFA. No Derby players allowed in this club, Luke Pingu. Here we go. Portuguese, right wing, Man Bernardo Silva. Nice. I keep forgetting as well that Cristiano Ronaldo is a striker now, isn't he? So you'd never get him in this combination. For a second then, though, guys, I'm not going to lie. I was like, hang on a minute. Bernardo Silva, though. 
Again, Premier League players. Like, Premier League players always have inflated prices. So, the good pack pull. It's actually a really nice kit down the other end as well. He's probably going to be worth around 3.5k, even though he's only got 78 pace. But the 83 passing, 89 dribbling as well. That's an insane stat. Again, it's going to be another decent card. Hopefully, just four minutes until the web app. Oh! Inform! CDM? Granite Jacker. I mean, I know he's 84 rated. Oh, also, by the way, don't hold your breath on the web app. But I know he's 84 rated. Is this card going to be usable? 52 pace. Let's be honest. 52 pace. Game clip recorded. I forgot that was even a thing on the Xbox, to be honest. It's been that long since we've packed a high-rated player. But Granite Jacker. Hmm. How much is he going to go for? He's already basically a min price card. That's crazy, dude. Quite a few of them already on the market as well. Yeah, would have much rather had like a Lozano or something. That would have been legit. Oh my god, back! German! Left mid! Back to back informs! I mean, again, another one who is going to be pretty pointless. Now, if this guy was a centre mid, he'd be a beast. 85 physical on a left midfielder. That's a. That's a strong left midfielder. However, again, do we even care about this card? Like, I feel like I've just used up my pack luck on two back to back cards that, like, nobody even cares about. I would have preferred that to be combined and got one good player instead of two, like, average informs. He's actually min price. He's basically a min price card already. Imagine if we got three in a row. What is going on? Dude, I was just trolling. Dude, I was trolling. What is happening? We just got three informs in a row. Like, I was just messing around saying back to back to back. Like, none of them have been any good, don't get me wrong, but still. What are the odds on that? That was actually pretty ridiculous. Mate, three in a row? I know. How is that even possible? To boards, though. Centre back? Bayern? Please. Sula. Actually, we'll take Sula. Sula's probably better than the informs that we just packed. But that's technically it's four boards in a row. Three informs. 183 plus rated card. Maybe if EA just, like, toggled the... How many players have we just got in that? But yeah, maybe EA have just toggled, like, the pack weight. So I've got to keep an eye out for that. A grey EA, EA sign. Boards. Okay. Centre back, the three. I mean, I would have much rather have had um, Van Dyke, But I, I won't say no to a three. 84 rated. Not bad. I honestly don't know why I went to the three instantly. Instead of going to Van Dyke, like being a Liverpool fan, I should have just instantly fought Van Dyke because that's what I would have wanted. However, 84 rated. I mean, I, I keep comparing the price on these pack pulled players, but at, at this like moment, it really makes no difference. The market's going to be so volatile. Like, you just don't know the price of cards, do we? Let's be honest. But yeah, again, like another decent pack pull. Um, no, like, nothing really to write home about yet, though. Best player I have used so far. Well, I can't really, like, I've not really used many players, so can't give you an honest opinion. Wait! Oh, it's Malcolm. Dude, is Coutinho right wing or left wing on this FIFA? I thought I might, oh, I honestly thought I had Coutinho for a second. 83 rated Malcolm? Like, he's probably the most expensive card that we've pack pulled. I know we've had higher, but, like, this dude's pace is dribbling, passing. Like, he's got a solid card. And, of course, being a forward, playing for Barcelona, always helps out. 
I reckon he's gonna go up in price. This is gonna be a weekend league card. 9.6k buy it now. Doesn't even look like he's gonna sell. I reckon by the time the game comes out officially, like the 30th or something, this is probably gonna be maybe about 15k. I think Mane. Mane, Van Dijk. They've probably been Liverpool's best players. Here we go. It's getting a boards. Centre back. PSG. Kim Pempe. Not bad. Kim Pempe is going to be worth a few coins as well, actually. 77 pace, 83 physical, 82 defending. That's a dangerous combo on a centre back, let's be honest. I would like to have been Thiago Silva, don't get me wrong. 10k plus, not bad. This has like a nice pack pull. High attack and high defensive work rates though. Not sure I'd prefer that on a centre back. 